how to fund your alter dice exchange account hello you're welcome my name is cj manuel in this video we'll be talking about how to fund your alter dice exchange account um especially in this regard we want to use it to get witty token in order to um subscribe to our automated crypto exchange system uh, did i say crypto exchange crypto trading rather automated crypto uh, crypto trading system so i'm making this video in order to guide us on one of the steps to get started so for us to get this sweetie token we need an authorized account which i have showed you guys how to create and now for you to buy your witty token you need to fund your authorized exchange account with either btc or usdt so in this video, we'll be talking about how to fund it with BTC. Whether you are funding with USDT, the process, the processes are just similar. But now we'll be talking about funding your authorized account with BTC. Then that BTC, we shall use it to buy the witty token for the subscription of this wonderful automated crypto trading system. Okay. So how do you fund your account? It's very simple, like every other platform it is very very simple so once you log into your authorized account the link to create your authorized account is in the description box of this video the link to get in touch with me is also in the description box of this video so every link you need is in the description box of this video if you're not subscribed to my channel please do well to subscribe click the subscribe button click the bell icon that pops up then select the all option so that whenever i release new videos on how to make money online or any other tutorial you will be notified if you are not subscribed and you didn't click the bell icon and the all option you will not be notified okay and also like i always say i'm not a financial advisor so don't see this video as a financial advice note vividly that you're solely responsible for any action you take or refuse to take as a result of watching this video you are 100 percent responsible for your decision now this video you may be seeing some figures thrown out because this automated trading uh, system is a very powerful system that will make you lots of money okay i mean lots of money but however how much you earn depends on the individual figures are not typical okay different people different results depending but um, so far so good this system is wonderful however do your own due diligence okay whatever i'm saying here is my own personal experience personal analysis personal observation the decision of whether or not to join is solely in your hands okay so now let's get into this make sure you watch this video to the end how do you fund your authorized account in order to use it to buy witty token for this automated crypto trading platform once you log into your account click deposits once you log into your account click deposits okay once you click deposit now you look for btc you want to fund you want to deposit btc to this account so you look for btc if you can find it or you just search for it here okay search for it btc As you type btc if it's not displaying automatically you click the search button here but it has already displayed so no need of clicking the search button now click here just click this btc bar here just click the btc bar now you have this okay now you have this okay we have everything in full now now this is your btc your authorized btc wallet address okay so you have to copy this uh, btc wallet address for you to copy just click this button uh, copy icon here okay just click the copy icon and then it's copy look at the top you see data successfully copied okay now it is copied now go to where you have your btc whether on binance whether on uh, trust wallet whether on uh, 
uh, Coinbase, blockchain, wherever you have your BTC, go there and send the BTC to this address. That is just it. That is just it. Okay. So in this video, we'll be using by um, Trust Wallet as an example. I said as an example. It doesn't matter where you have your BTC. The important thing is send that BTC to this address you copied. If you don't know how to send BTC from the platform you are using, go on YouTube and search. Maybe let's say, for example, you are using Binance. So go to YouTube and search how to uh, send BTC from Binance to another account. You will see video guides to guide you. So in this video, we'll be using Trust Wallet. We have our BTC in Trust Wallet, so we'll be using it as an example for this video. So let's go to our Trust Wallet account. So here we go, we are here in our Trust Wallet account. And um, so you see these are different cryptocurrencies. So let's select the one we want to send, uh, which is BTC. So click there, just click there so that BTC platform will open. And now we are here now in the BTC platform of our Trust Wallet. So now you click send we are because we are sending this BTC out from this Trust Wallet. So you click send, okay? so let's click the send and then you see your recipient address meaning where are you sending the btc to now remember the wallet the btc wallet address of authorized account which we copied that is what we are going to paste here so now click and then press hold click paste okay then what is the amount of btc we want to send okay so you type the amount of btc you want to send here in case you don't know the value of btc you want to send you can always uh do your research let's say for example you want to send um 400 and uh, uh 230 dollar btc let's say you want to send 230 dollar btc so you can easily come to your search you can easily come here Come to your set, uh, browser, uh, convert USD, USD to BTC. Okay. Just click the, I'm just taking my time. I know a lot of you guys know what to do, but I'm just taking my time because of newbies, people that don't even have any idea. Okay. So now let's say you want to send here is the dollar column here is the btc column so we want to send one uh, 230 dollar btc so this um 230 dollar worth of btc so which means 230 dollar gives us 0 0.0040 btc you get that okay so we are sending 0 0.0040 btc that is how to know how much you are sending now to also be on the safer side you can add let's say you want to send exactly 230 you can add transaction fee of like let's say five dollar okay or transaction fee of let's say ten dollar um uh, ten dollar that will be 40 okay so when you put your transaction fee there to give you an idea of what you may be needing to send depending on how your ex your the wallets you have your btc works because some wallets deducts the transaction fee from what you are sending while some deducts is from your balance so it's depending so so now let's put the amount of btc we want to send here which is 0 0.004 0 0.004 okay it's even showing us here you see so some wallet doesn't do this i'm just going through all these different processes for you to uh you know use common sense to know what to do so it's already showing here that is nice so um for uh let me just make it four two okay let me just leave it at four let me leave it at this because it will be enough for what I want to use it for. It will be enough. So let me just leave it at that. So I haven't done that. You can click 
haven't done that you can now click the continue button at the top hope you are seeing the continue button at the top so continue So you see what they are charging here. Um, here they are, they are charging about ten dollar for transaction fee. So ten dollar plus uh, the thirty one dollar we are sending gives you a total of two hundred and um, ten dollar plus the two hundred and thirty one dollar we are sending gives a total of uh, two hundred and forty one dollars. So in this case now they are collecting from balance, but in some wallets they will collect from what you are sending. That means you have to send more so that when the transaction fee is deducted it won't affect the actual money you are sending so you have to be very observant to know how the deduction is being made so that you know how to what you'll be sending okay i hope you understand that so click send click send and when you look at the total here you should make sure you have up to this amount in your balance make sure you have up to this amount in your balance otherwise it won't go through this is the total we are sending. You ask yourself, do you have up to this amount in your balance here? Okay. Otherwise, it won't go. So let's click the send button. As you can see at the bottom here. Okay. Transaction error not enough. Okay. Let's go back. Okay, what I did is that I reduced the number of Bitcoin I'm sending out to to cover up for other uh, fees, whatever they called it. But I ended up sending um, a total of 226, sorry. I ended up sending a total of 226, okay. So that's what I ended up sending so that there will be enough money to pay one other fees about I think about five dollar more was charged but five dollar more was charged so a total of about minus the transaction fee of ten dollar we take we create space for another five dollar or ten dollar more depending so in a nutshell, what I did was just to reduce the number of bitcoins I'm sending, so it it now went successfully. Okay, because uh, the number of bitcoin I wanted to send initially did not take cognizance of the additional fee they were charging, so I have to reduce the number of bitcoins to accommodate that. So as you can see now, the transaction is pending. Okay. The transaction is pending now if you click this now you can now see the details if you click here now you see the details at least you should have three confirmation here now you have zero confirmation once this gets up to two to three confirmation it will then reflect in our authorized account okay now we are having zero bitcoin here so it's going to reflect here once it reflects in our authorized account we can then use it to buy the other token I was talking about in order to pay for the subscription of this wonderful automated crypto trading bot. It's, it's crypto trading bot. It's not Forex trading. It's not a, a, a other kind of trading. It's crypto, purely crypto trading. And, the, and this system is working very, very well. Okay. So guys, that is it. All the link you need is in the description box of this video. So go there and explore, find the links you need, including the link to get to contact me. Everything is there, okay? So if you want to get in touch with me directly, this is my Telegram group link. Once you get here, go click the discussion button. And this link is a general link where I discuss everything I do online. So it may be noisy to you. Just tell us why you are there and I will direct you appropriately. And this is my WhatsApp link. Once you click this, you'll be right there in my inbox. You can WhatsApp me and get in touch with me. 
if this video was useful to you please do well to share subscribe to my channel don't forget to subscribe give this video a thumb up i want every one of you to give it a thumb up okay give it a thumb up and share thank you very much i remain your cj manuel bye